I think uh, an initiative like yours, which is engaging people, doing something themselves, not remaining passive, but becoming active players themselves, understanding that this is a very important part of their future, I think that's an important step. We've tried to do our bit by establishing a Washington office already in 2009, and we tried to integrate as many young people into our operations as students. We are staying in contact afterwards. We give them the possibility also to experience our work in the European Parliament. They have a stage there for two months. Uh, I think that's very important uh, because the transatlantic relationship at the end of the day is the cornerstone for, uh, for the West. And we have much more in common than, uh, than others. So if that relationship should remain alive, we need to engage young people. I mean, it's my first time here, but what I like very much is that you are organizing in chapters. So it's not just an annual event, there's a lot of preparation, there's a lot of outreach. Uh, it's outreach here in the United States to many universities, not just the traditional ones which are engaged with Europe, but going beyond. And I think that's, that's important to broaden the movement. I also understand that you will set a foot into Europe, you are expanding there, you have contacts already to some very renowned research institutes. Uh, I've seen that uh, also in during that conference here, Participants are not just passive, but are taking a very active role. They have prepared policy papers, which then they are adapting. And I think that's a very good method.